Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, have another review for you today. Um, this time, Halloween Wolf. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, so let's look at her up close in her box, and then I'll take her out. So I had to get this Halloween because I love her pink hair. I love the little blue streaks in her hair and the pink hair. I love that little floppy ear. Reminds me of my dog, Odin. And then this is the Creepateria. Yes, this is the Creepateria. I love the artwork on this box right here. It's beautiful. And then let's look at the back, and then the back artwork is beautiful too. Um, you guys probably noticed, you probably have seen my little crafty thing here. What I'm doing is I'm cutting out each of the, each of the, whenever I get a doll, I cut out the, like, little back art, like Halloween's right here. I, I'll cut that out and then paste it on there. I, I would love to do this, but it's just so big that I don't think it'll fit there. But anyways, um, yeah, and then this is, I'll pause this here right here for a minute so you can read it and pause it if you need to. So yeah, this is the Creepateria Halloween. Um, I think that there is a Cleo Denial as well. Like, think a Torlai? I'm not sure. I, I only found her. I've seen the Cleo though. So, let me get her out of the box. And we're back. So, here she is out of the box. Look at her face. You can definitely see the resemblance between Claudine and Howling. Um, and of course, Claude and, and Claudia. Um, I like her new look better than her old one. Her hair, her hair just, head is kind of wobbly. Um, but yeah, here's her hair. I love her hair. Just the pink and the... Her head really is well. Like she's almost a bobblehead. Whoosh. Oh well. But I love the, the, the pink, or the blue stripes. And you can see them right here in the light better. Um, I promise, guys, I'll get better light. Um, so here's her little shirt. Let me get rid of this down here. So it's purple with like a zebra print with little puppy paw prints all over it. It's just beautiful. And then she's got a little bracelet here. Here's her lunch. I'm not exactly sure what that is. What is that? It looks like some kind of hot dog or sloppy joe. And then some kind of milk and a little coffin lunch tray. Probably just put that in my accessories bin. And then look at her, her uh, skirt. It's really pretty. It's... I would totally wear it if I could. Um, let me bring this back over into the light some more so you can see. It's got an ombre effect with pink, purple, and blue. A little bit of turquoise. And then, of course, the shoes. I love the shoes. And then, of course, this doll was $10 at Walmart, so... I mean, it's not going to be super duper detailed, but I love the fact that they're unlaced. That happens to me all the time. Just walking on the street and a trip over my damn lace. But they're really pretty. And on the bottom, see anything on the bottom? Nope. So yeah, that's Halloween. Um, I really love her, f her face makeup. It's really pretty. Um, I love her eyes. Her makeup's kind of subtle. And again, I love her hair and that floppy ear. Um, so yeah, I mean... If... I was going... You know, I mean, I did buy the doll. Oh, look at that little bracelet! I just realized that she has this really pretty cute little bracelet and it's all spiked. It's almost like... Helen's style is almost like she took Draculaura style and... Claudia style and kind of smashed them together. The pink and the spike. So you got that, guys. That's my review on Halloween Wolf. 
um, go ahead and give a like and a thumbs up and have a good day guys love you bye